Okay, I'd like to show you how to use, I think, fan captions to uh, annotate or create subtitles for a video. So I'm inside YouTube, I'm logged in, and uh, this is a video, a uh, basic video on Khan Academy. So I go to this uh, settings wheel here, open that, and I go to the subtitles. So then the first thing you probably want to do is see if somebody's subtitled into your language. So I'm looking for Swedish. There is Spanish, Swahili, no Swedish. So I'm good. So I should probably subtitle this. So I'll open the Add Subtitles. This will take me into this, where I now select the language. I'll choose Swedish. And this will give me the time li timeline on the left, where I can add my edits. So as you see here, whoops, why is it stuck? Let's take this one. If we have two groups, in each group I have four, so I click below that, and that's where you enter your text. So if you want to have some help to get started, you can use the auto translate feature. Press auto translate. I'm assuming it's going to use Google Translate. It will then automatically give you the groups, and if and you're anything like our language, Swedish, most of this is not going to be useful, uh, partly because it's going to be a text translation, which is going to be wrong in many cases, and then in partly because it's just not going to be the way you want to speak if you want to use this for subtitling at least. Uh, sorry, for dubbing. So I'll, I'll try and make a video on how I dub as well, but this was just how you get into this and how you do it. Then you keep filling out this thing to the end. It takes a while. You would, uh, of course, replace the ones that don't work. Eventually, you get to the end. You're done. You can see the timeline on the video here on the right, where you can skip back and forth. And when you're done, you hit Submit Contribution. And then it gives you an option. I won't do it now, because I'm not sure what's going to happen. Uh, it will ask you if you want to submit it for final uh, submission or if you want it to be open for other people to edit it. It seems like you can't edit anybody else's, so if somebody already contributed something and you're not happy with that translation, uh, I'm not exactly sure what to do. I'd love to have feedback on that. All right. Uh, if you want credit for the contribution, you check this thing. And as I said, I'm logged in, so I'm not sure what happens if you're not logged in. I haven't tried. But that's how I do it anyway. All right. Thanks.